Howdy for the Lux and Nace Home. Today, well, we're going to be doing a video on a DIY recurve bow target. So, here, I didn't break it. Alright, that's good. Well, here's my recurve. And um, I tried this out earlier just to make sure it worked before I made the video on it. So, um, so well, let's go outside and let me show y'all what we're going to be using. Well, first of all, video. this is going to be an arrow, just a light arrow, nothing fancy. And, um, well, this is going to be a recurve right, we so, use. Well, those are two things you're going to need. Well, first two things. Piece of paper and, well, a sharpie. So, get those two things and... Then after that, y'all, you're going to need a cardboard box and a comforter for your bed. So, yes, I know that sounds weird. Squirrely, what are you talking about? A comforter? Yes, a comforter. So, I got one. I bought one. I mean, it's just nothing special. Just a cheap thing. And um, I was like, well, I think this will stop an arrow. So, well, I got one and a cardboard box. So, first of all, we're going to draw our target on that. And then we're going to go build the target. Alright y'all, so now we're going to draw us a target here. Alright, well, got to get the paper open first. So I kind of came up with this idea of, well, I seen the comfort, I was like, oh, well, that, that might be a good video. So I'm just going to use the back of this paper. And, well, I'm just going to try, I'm just going to try to draw, like, lungs on a deer. That's what I'm going to draw. Um, I guess they would, huh. Then like down here could be like the heart, I guess. I think this series is gonna work. And well, there we go. We got us a target. Now I need a golf tee. I think I got one somewhere, y'all. Maybe I can find it. Alright, y'all. Well, I thought I had one. Let me go find All my right, bow. Box. Well apparently I've lost my bow box. I have no idea where it went, but hey. We got some broken arrows. We're just going to stab one of the arrows in the target and use that as our well, golf. This one here ought to do the job. And, well, sorry about the mess. Yeah, I was looking for stuff for this video and, well, I kind of didn't clean it back up. But I got, I got field tips in this mess somewhere. Matter of fact, we're just going to use a crossbow tip right here. This is not made, oh, well, there goes the camera. This is not made for this, but hey, it's going to work. That's all I can say. Alright y'all, so now we're going to make the bow target. So what you're going to need is a cardboard box, just like this. This got wet earlier, so it's not going to be as good, I don't expect. And well, you're going to need your comforter. Yeah, it's got dirty, it was white, and I left it outside. Well, it rained, so yeah. But you're just going to pack it in there just like that. And you can fold your box or you cannot fold your box. Either way works. And well, we'll do that. Well, there's your target. So, as y'all can tell, I shot it earlier just to make sure this video would work. And I just make it and then hoped it worked. So, now we're gonna we're gonna make a hole for a target. Alright, there's that hole. Make this one. Well, feed the arrow through. Alright, well, there we go. Now our target's made. Let me walk over here and grab y'all. So, target's made now. See, there's the target. And, um, well, we're going to take the recurve. I'm going to put my glove on. And um, we're going to set the target up out here in the yard. And, um, well, then we're going to shoot it. So, well... Let's set this bad boy up. I'm going to set it out here about, I don't know, 10 yards or so. And, um, well, I'm going to put y'all right there. I can get my camera set up. Oh, now, the, now the dog's going to go crazy. I'm going to like center lungs and um, hope for the best. I hit it and it stopped the arrow as y'all can tell very well so let's see how much penetration we got very easy to pull out that's always good we got about six inches of penetration so let's try that again we're gonna give it three shots right through here and hopefully it'll stop them off
So that was more center of, of the target. And we'll just see what happened. Yeah. Got about just a little bit more penetration and um, center. Now we're going to go for the bottom of the target. Gonna try to go for the bottom of the white paper, y'all. All right, y'all. Well, as y'all can tell, I mean, it looked like it stopped it pretty good on that shot too. Well, we got quite a bit more penetration on that one, but it's probably all on how you've packed your comforter. But hey, I mean, it stops at a cardboard box and a comforter. Hey, this is a right good bow target. All right, John, as I have mentioned, I made this just for a recurve. I haven't made this for a compound or a crossbow. I haven't tried that out. Maybe if y'all want me to try it out in the next video or something, maybe I'll try it out. But, um, well, I'm going to shoot it probably 15, 20 more times and see how the target holds right, up. So now I'm literally, like, I'm touching the target. So now we're going to we're gonna draw back and let her fly. Ooh. Okay, well, let's... Well, Alright y'all, I hope you liked today's video, and um, I don't know what happened to those last clips. I lost them. I have no idea what I did with them. I must have deleted them somehow. I must have accidentally deleted them. I don't know. Something messed up. I don't have them. I looked. I made this video a long time ago, and yeah, I don't know where the clips went. But um, either way, that recurve, I've been shooting it. None. Uh, I gave up on it, honestly. Um, So yeah. I haven't shot it. It's deer season now. Actually, I deer hunted today, yesterday, and the day before. Haven't killed anything yet, but hey, y'all know it's it's going. I'm trying to kill a deer. Trying to get one down for y'all. But um, either way, hope you like today's video. And I would recommend that for a recurve. That is a really like a really cheap bow target. It don't take much. All you need is a cardboard box and a comforter, and you can shoot that a million times, and it don't look like it affects none. But um, either way, don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.